will not be placed under lockdown in at least the next two months, but the main COVID-19 restrictions will still be in place at Christmas. Hello, this is Catalan News in 100 seconds, today from Barcelona's most iconic landmark, the Sagrada Familia. The Public Health Secretary, Josep Maria Simón, says confinement will not happen at least until November because hospitals are under far less stress than in the spring. Yet, the ban on social gatherings of over 10 people will still be in force at Christmas, as well as the requirement to wear face masks. Catalonia and Spain's governments might meet in the coming weeks after both presidents agreed to prepare a summit. It'd be the second time the negotiation table over the Catalan conflict convenes. Yet, what to tackle continues to be a contentious point. Considerem que s'ha de poder parlar de l'exercici del dret a l'autodeterminació i de l'amnistia i, per tant, doncs nosaltres demanarem que a l'ordre del dia s'hi puguin abordar aquests temes. Keeping his representative functions as Catalan president. This is what far-left Coop proposes for Kim Torre in the event he is ousted for disobedience. The unionist opposition was outraged at the idea. Si és inhabilitat i mentre no hi hagi eleccions en aquest temps de trànsit o de transició, segueixi exercint plenament les funcions que són pròpies al president de la Generalitat. Ja n'hi ha prou de desprestigiar les institucions del país i en concret, en aquest cas, la, la presidència de la Generalitat. The Performing Arts Fair Fira Tàrrega will be held online tomorrow and on Thursday due to the pandemic. A virtual marketplace for professional performers will be the main highlight. The Sagrada Familia keeps on offering an unprecedented site. No tourists, and the temple is only open on weekends. Locals can visit for free, but tickets run out very quickly. Next week, there will be a raffle, and anyone can take part to get one of the 12,000 tickets available for September 18th to the 20th.